Hello ladies and gents, welcome to another Star Citizen video. Today is going to be a little bit different. We're going to be talking about the Crusader, Ares and Ion. Actually on July 28th, a Spectrum thread was posted pertaining to the point of quickly overwhelm enemies of all sizes. When it comes to the description of the Ares itself specifically, and I'm going to read exactly what it says here. What they highlighted, it says about this ship, take out massive capital class vessels in a single seater fighter from Crusader. It says enormous SF-7B ballistic Gatling can quickly overwhelm enemies of all sizes with a devastating sustained barrage of armor piercing rounds. So now this is the key point here that they have mentioned pertaining to the description of the Ares before they sold it even during the concept sale and everything um, which is the reason why people purchased it. This is the third point here it says 12 missiles and an oversized shield keeping bogeys off your back in close combat. So ideally the Crusader Ares specifically was supposed to be a very scary ship to run into in the battlefield and it was when it initially released but CIG nerfed it not too long after it was sold and it was released and all that and a lot of people are not happy about that and so recently they got a reply pertaining to what we may see for the 320 build so yogi class cig says hello everyone i asked the weapon balance peeps for the pu to pull forward some changes for the aries weaponry a tiny amount of aim assist will be deducted to both the ion and infernal weapons the barrel ballistic gatling size 4 to 7 spread changes from 0 0.5 to 1 degree to 0.3 to 0.4 degrees this means the minimum spread is reduced by 40 percent and the maximum spread is by 60 percent you need to double these values to get the actual spread angle they should be coming in 3.20 these values will probably change again when we move over the aim stuff but this is still a while off so now this is the answer a lot of people have been looking for for them to actually update the aries both the ion and the inferno now with this change in 320 with a lot of the reader commander um, updates coming in it's going to be very exciting to actually fly this ship we're actually going to start seeing Ares, Infernos, and Ions back on the battlefield because of this change and I'm very excited to actually get my hands on one once again. For those that already melted it, you should look into getting it back. You guys let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'll see you on the next video.